Breaking news off the top at 10. Two people are dead inside a North Shore home. Right now, state police detectives and the crime lab are combing through that Peabody home. And WBZ's Ken McLeod is live at that crime scene tonight for us. Ken? Liam, within the past 30 minutes, police have towed a car away from this intersection. It's the intersection of Oak and Winter Streets. Now, they believe that car belongs to a man who carried out a murder-suicide just a few houses down where police are still huddled in front of 11 Winter Street. As you can still see, a very active crime scene with two bodies apparently still on the front porch there. As a swarm of officers worked a taped off stretch of Winter Street tonight, neighbors felt violent crime hit close to home. Really close. I mean, you wouldn't expect it to be this close, but I guess, I don't know, anything's possible now, right? It was just before 6.30 when relatives of the 51-year-old woman who lives here called police after a disturbing long-distance clue. She was on the phone with a relative in Brazil. That relative heard a commotion and an altercation and the line went dead. Arriving officers discovered the woman stabbed to death and a man they have not yet ID'd also dead from self-inflicted knife wounds just outside the front door. On the steps to this house here at 11 Winter Street, it outside appears the outside the home, yes. Police declined to discuss chatter from neighbors indicating that the female victim had recently broken up with a hot-headed boyfriend. A lot of it goes on just anywhere now. It doesn't matter where you live, I don't think, anymore. Even the small towns have it now, so it's, it's not good. At this point, police have released no names, and they're telling us not to expect any probably until tomorrow morning. Police do say, however, they have had no previous trouble, no calls of any sort at this address. Live in Peabody tonight, Ken McLeod, WBZ News.